Welcome! In front of me I have Garmin Vivo Move style and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with a phone via the Garmin Connect application. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue and now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the Garmin Connect application and, and your phone to send the notifications to your watch. So first, find the Garmin Connect application icon. Once you find it, press and hold on it, then tap on Add App Info. Uh, here, find the permissions and tap on it. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed. Uh, so I recommend to allow the contacts. Basically tap on them, tap on allow and go back. Phone. And also I recommend to allow the call logs, calendar and SMS. Once you allow uh, the permissions, you can close this page. Now open the settings on your phone. In settings, find the notification access option. Uh, on my phone, it's quite easy. You can tap on notifications and tap on notification access. But if you can't find it on your phone, go to the main page of settings, tap on search and type in a notification. Um, access. Oh, my bad. Like that. And it should redirect you to it. Once you find the notification access, tap on it. And you should see this page where you have allowed list and not allowed. And as you can see, Garmin Connect is not the on the not allowed list. We need to move it up. To do it, tap on Garmin Connect. Find the option called allow notification access with the switch next to it. Tap on the switch. Tap on allow and then go back. And the Garmin Connect app will appear on the allowed list. Now we can close the settings, open the Garmin Connect application. In the app, we can tap on more, scroll down, find the Garmin devices and tap on it. And here we can select our Vivo Move style. Now find the alerts option, tap on it and tap on smart notifications. And here we have two stages or um, states of the watch during activity and not during activity. Basically, uh, during activity is when you're uh, tracking activity or recording a workout on your watch, like running, cycling and stuff like that. And not during activity is when you're not doing anything on your watch, basically, rather when you're not tracking activity. So uh, anything else but tracking activity on your watch. And you can enable and disable notifications for two states of the watch. Once you enable them, you can also tap on show and select uh, which types of notifications should be displayed uh, during activity or not during activity. So select the ones you like. And once you're done, you can close the app. Oh no, my bad. And uh, don't close the app. Uh, let's go back because the settings won't save if you close the app. So go back to the um, Vivo Move style, alerts, uh, smart notifications, enable them, customize the settings to your liking. And instead of closing the app, go back to the device page. And once you go back to the device page, you will see settings saved successfully and the watch will sync with your phone. That means that the settings saved and you can, if you're not sure that the watch uh, synced with your phone, you can also tap on this icon to force sync them. And now when we go back, we will see that the settings um, saved. Now we can close the app. And at this point, a point rather, we should be able to receive the notifications. So I'm gonna send myself notification or other message. As you can see, we got it on our phone and also on our watch. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.